I don't wanna turn 25 Don't know what I'm doing with my life Hi friends, welcome or welcome back to my channel. Today I am going to be doing a birthday vlog. I just woke up so that's why I look really tired but we are about to get ready and I wanted to go to Bopomofo for my birthday lunch and I wanted to get some birthday freebies on the way home. I work at four so I think I can get ready and go do a few things before work. I'm going to get ready real quick and then we will head out. Something tells me I should keep on trying But giving up seems way too nice this is my outfit for today. I got the flannel from Princess Polly, Top, Hollister, and pants from Fashion Nova. I'm having an allergy attack right now, so if you're wondering, that's why my skin is red. I have eczema and like my skin just flares up every once in a while. I didn't have time to do my hair, so I just put it up. So I'm going to look like an egg for today because work is at four and it is currently two. So we have to start heading out. We are going to go get Bopo Mofo first. And then I have a few freebies. I think I might get nothing but cakes or fencha, depending on the time. So I'll see you guys back in my car. We are 25 minutes away from the place. So I'm glad there's no traffic because it's already like two and people try and get out of work like early and stuff to head home. I really do look like an egg. But I'm so sorry to do my hair. I'll do it later for like pics and stuff. Don't fall, don't fall, don't fall. <laughs> my apartment complex is empty right now because everyone's at work. This looks better, but you guys are going to fall when I drive. So I'll just talk really fast while we are at this red light. So usually when I first get into a car, I've been listening to BTBT by BI. And that's all I listen to because the song is just so catchy. I've been listening to the song right when it first released and it's like my number one every time I get into a car. And just like when I do like daily activities, this is all I listen to. So my friends probably think I'm crazy because that's all I listen to. I have no variety with my playlist for some reason. Ah, you guys are falling. I'm sorry if you guys can't see me. This is the only way I can like leave my camera there without it falling. Is there like a camera holder? I will see vlogs of people talking with the camera, but like I don't understand how it doesn't fall or maybe they use their phone. Oh, they probably use their phone, huh? This little ear is like in the way, <laughs> but I will see you guys at the Boba Shop. All of my friends are doing things. Yeah, well, I drive alone down empty streets. It's like I should be. Half an hour later, and we made it. I don't know, you guys can see. Okay, that's close it around. I can't see the road, so how? Well, how does my future play? There's a sugar cream place next door that I want to try, so let's try it. Oh, they're closed today. I went to the sugarcane store next door, like two stores down, and the guy sitting outside said they were closed, and he said they also have like a hollow hollow place near here. But I didn't really understand what he was saying, and I was craving more for sugarcane than like the dessert. Now we are going to go back home to Feng Chao, which is near my place, so that's going to be a 25 minute drive. So I'm going to get my free cake there, and then I was going to do something. Oh, I was going to go to Gong Cha for my free drink. I really want a sugar cane, but it's okay. I can always get sugar cane another time. And then if we have time, we're going to stop by Nothing But Cakes, but I don't think we have time because by the time I get there, it's going to be 3.30 already, and I have to be back home before for work. I had an allergy attack, so my whole chest was red. I don't know what I'm allergic to still, but I'm allergic to something here because my chest is so red, so that's why I bind up my flannel if you were wondering. I got a boba milk tea because I am basic. <laughs> hmm. Let's get back on the road and I'll see you guys in a bit. Cause I don't wanna let my mom down. I don't wanna turn 25. Don't know what I'm doing with my life. Something tells me I should keep on trying. Hi you guys, I'm back. I just finished work and I'm looking a little bit crusty right now. So I will probably take 
some birthday pics tomorrow. I also was supposed to carve my pumpkin today, but I don't know why. I've just been really tired lately, so I'll probably carve my pumpkin tomorrow. So instead of a birthday vlog, it's kind of like the first two days of November vlog. I don't know what I'm going to name it yet, but when I name it, I'll let you guys know. I think I'll head to Gongcha for my free drink and then after maybe stop by Michael's or Target. I wanted to see if Halloween candy was on sale. I know it's 30% off usually the day after Halloween. And by the time it reaches like 75%, like all the candy's gone. So I usually just go the day after Halloween. And for like other Halloween items, I usually wait until it's on sale. Like I just see like whatever's still good. I worked for three hours today. I start my new job tomorrow. So I'm excited about that. I also was checking out my work email and they have like this little recognition like website now so you get points every time you get recognized for like doing something really good at work and i just checked my profile because it said i had a recognition and apparently i have like 500 points so that means i can redeem it for something these are the things that i can redeem it for like the sticker it looks really cool so maybe i'll get a sticker because i don't have a work sticker yet a pen is 500 points and i have a bunch of pens that i leave everywhere so i think i'm good on that i think it's really cool that they have amazon cards i have 515 points and i don't know how i got those points but <laughs> i didn't know i had points at all and the most expensive thing is this yeti cooler this fits eight soft coolers so it fits like eight of the drinks i'm guessing i don't even know if that's english right now wait what it says yeti hooper flip eight soft cooler does that mean okay i'm assuming it fits like eight drinks i'm too tired for this but i think that's what it means yeah, so, but I don't think I would ever have enough points for that. That's like 20,000 points. So I thought that was cool that you can redeem stuff. So I don't know if I want a sticker or if I want to save for a gift card. My allergies were acting up so much today. I don't know why my allergies flared up today. My whole chest was so red. I don't know why my skin's like this. Did I change into something comfortable? There's all my squishmallows. That's all the clothes because I didn't know what to wear today. So let's head on to Gongcha and Target and maybe Michael's if they're still open because I want to check out the sale. Why is this hair sticking up? Okay, just ignore my baby hairs. Spending my time, spending my money all on a daydream. How do you make everyone listen saying the wrong thing? I don't know why every time I go to Target, I go in for like one thing and I come out with like a cart full of stuff. I specifically went to Target for Halloween stuff because today is the day after Halloween. So they have a bunch of stuff on clearance and milk. I totally forgot about the milk, but I was able to get some Halloween and Christmas stuff. I want to wait until my next video to show you guys my Christmas stuff, but I'll show you guys a sneak peek of what I got. I saw these ornament drink cups and I just had to get them. Oh my gosh, you're so cute. I say that in literally every video, but I just had to get them. They're so aesthetic. Each one was $3. I got in the clear color and this clear orange color. They also had it in the gold and silver color. These are what they look like. I'm ready to decorate for Christmas and hopefully I can get that video out early this time, but I just put up like all of my Halloween stuff. So I don't know when I'm going to decorate yet. Let's move on to my Halloween stuff. So did I need this? Did I get it because it was on sale and I can use it for next year? Yes, I did. I got a pumpkin waffle maker. This was 50% off. So this is $6 and originally it was $12. They also have the ghost and the bat one and a spider web one, but I don't like spiders. So the pumpkin was the best choice for me. I don't eat waffles, but if I tell myself I'm going to use it, I'll use it. So I'm just going to manifest that I'll use this for next year. Next, I got these Halloween eggs that I will be using for next year. I got a pack of them for this year to put in my goodie bags. And I really like these because you don't really see these. So I wanted to get some for next year. This was on sale for $150. I was so excited when I saw these. I love making gingerbread houses even though they take forever and I get tired of them like halfway through. But I got a haunted house village and I will be making my brother do it with me. This was $9 and it used to be $13. It comes with a whole village set. So you have to put together your village like your 
houses. I got a whole bunch of candy. Also, these Target bags are great and they're usually white, so I think that's pretty cool. This isn't Halloween, but I saw Pokemon snacks. Anything Pokemon, I feel like I have to get it. These are the Ritz crackers. All the candy was 30% off. I got M&Ms. I love M&Ms and Kit Kats. So I got three of the M&Ms. This is peanut butter. <gasps> Oh my gosh, I didn't know this was peanut butter. I got it because it says Ghoul's Mix. This is the second pack of M&M's I got. The third one I got is the original milk chocolate Ghoul's Mix. The next chocolate I got were the Dracula Kisses. These are strawberry filling. I really like the design on it. It's in a purple design and there's little red bags in them. I got two bags of these ones. Tic Tacs were on sale, so I got the orange ghost one. I thought there would be ghosts on it, but the packaging is just ghost theme. You never know when you might need a Tic Tac. The last three chocolates I got were Dove. I really like Dove, especially their dark chocolate one. I know not a lot of people like dark chocolate, but I really like it. And when you eat dark chocolate, you're somewhat healthy. This one has the green pumpkin design, very festive. And I have the regular milk chocolate. This is in the orange packaging with the pumpkins on the breast. That's all I have for my Halloween Target haul. And the rest is my Christmas haul, so I will be making that video for you guys soon. Jaisa got me this huge octopus from Costco and I'm so excited to add them to my Squishmallow collection on my bed, but I don't even know if this will fit because this is literally the size of my brother. It was so crazy and look at the little like tentacles at the bottom. I didn't know these were tentacles. I didn't even know this was an octopus. Doesn't look like a stingray. Her name is Loretta and she's just the cutest. This one is her bag. It's so pretty. I saw her hold the bag and I was like, oh, who's it for? And she was just all like, oh, it's for my coworker. Like the bag was like empty. It was like flat and she was just holding it. And I really thought it was for her coworker. But then I saw in her room and I saw like birthday wrapping. So I knew that was for me in the end. The first thing I got is tissue paper. Yay. Her and Kara got me matching penguins. This is the one she gave me. And this is the one that Kara got me. They're so cute. I'm going to put this out on my counter to display them. I honestly was going to get these at Miniso and I think they were like, don't buy it. So I'm really excited to add more penguins to my collection. The next thing she got me was from Lush. She asked me what I wanted for my birthday and I really wanted more bath bombs. I honestly would love anything anyone gets me, even if you get me a pet rock. I would be so excited to put it on my counter because I don't know, I just love collecting things and if I were to get a rock, I would be so happy. What I like about this bag, look, it's a bat. Fly. Isn't that so cool? Oh my gosh, I didn't realize this is like a drawstring backpack. Oh my gosh, and there's even a happy birthday tag. I didn't see this when I opened it. I already opened it in front of her, but I usually rewrap all my gifts to open it on the day of my birthday. So in this box, we have three bath bombs. There's this pumpkin one, there's a bat one, and there's a foot. There's also an instruction manual in this box, and they have a description of all the bath bombs inside. They also have the sparkly pumpkin shower slime. So I'm guessing the shower gel. It smells really good. This is what it looks like. It spilled a bit, so I left it in the wrapping. The next two things she got me are from Morphe or Morph. Everyone tells me different things, but this is a blush and this is a palette. I really like her theme for my presents, like orange, so it's Halloween. And I've been really needing a new blush because I ran out my Rare Beauty one. So she got me these two. This blush bomb is so pretty. I really like the packaging for it. And this is inside. This is the 9E palette. This is the Pretty in Peach. The box color is different from the palette. This is more in an orange color and this is more in a pink color. She got me a travel size one because she realized that the big ones I usually leave at home and the small ones I usually bring with me. It's just because it's more convenient. I'm more of a neutral color person, so I usually just use brown and pinks. The next present I have is from Kara. I really like this bag. Look how aesthetic it is. I love marble stuff and anything glittery, so this bag is just perfect. She got me this reversible penguin, so there's a happy one. And when we opened it, it was so funny. It looked like this. She also got me penguin ice mold. So when you put it together, you use this to put in your water so it doesn't spill. The last thing she got me was this boba attic hoodie. And on the back, look, it's me. She got this at the night market and this hoodie is so soft. I actually wore it already, even though it was before my birthday. The last present I have is from my brother. She asked me what I wanted for my birthday and I told her I wanted shoes and socks and I got shoes. Here's my box. She didn't even take out the shoes or the shipping label. So she just wrapped the shipping box. This is definitely something that my brother would do. I got Air Forces like always. My new ones just got dirty and I always get white. I really like the aesthetic of it. Here are my new shoes, you guys. I really wanted more of like a neutral brown white aesthetic. So I wanted these Nikes. The bottom is even in a neutral color. It's not like white, it's like cream 
yellow brown i don't know how to describe the color but i really like it air forces are so comfy i have like four pairs already and i never get tired of them i'm done with my target haul and unboxing all my presents so let's move on to blowing out the candles for my cake i will be lighting my boba birthday cake that i got for free today at feng Shui, and that will be the ending to this video so let's light it together here's what the cake looks like it like melted Happy birthday. Okay, let me make a wish. 